whatever. Joe North Platte. Hello, everybody from Iowa City and Cedar Rapids and points east and south, north, and west. Um, <laughs> well, we, it's kind of an inactive day today, but we would, I, would, I want to give a shout out to uh, Dahl Ford. You know, uh, this has been an excellent ride. It's been nice really it's yeah. very good. Uh, we've had some good food on the trip. And uh, what did you have for lunch there, Joe? I didn't yeah. have chicken today, but I, I, <laughs> I've had uh, beef burritos and, and tamales, and this is a really good place. So, yeah. yeah. So, what did you think of yesterday? What did you say? It was awesome. It was completely awesome. It was really a fun Enjoyed day. Chase. Uh, the nice thing about you know, you know, to tell all the kids, you know, if you have any, uh, uh, if you want a good STEM career, meteorology is for you. As a self uh, taught meteorologist, I've learned more today than or, or this last two days than uh, I knew of all these years. So That's thanks great. to these guys. So, yeah. Completely. Yeah. 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 And look yeah. at your plate. You cleaned your plate. Yeah, you I cleaned it. Yeah, I got it. It's, it's in the club stuff. there. Yeah. See, Colby, your plate yeah. is gone. Oh, yeah, I'm, oh, I'm, yeah, I'm doing gone. good. Feeling good. What did you have, Colby? Uh, the Jalisco. Shrimp. Uh, what was there? Peppers. Rice. Onions. Uh, cheese, a whole bunch of crap. <laughs> Feeling good though. Jessa, uh, what are you going Jesse, after? Jesse, what are you uh, having? Taco action. Well, it's tacos, but if I keep eating the shell, I, I'm not going to make it. You're not going to make it. Well, it looks good. It does look Thank good. You. I got this little cilantro on there. And Chips and salsa were yeah, really outstanding. There are not many left of those. Right. Going so, back down to the end of the table there, you know, you Blaine's, got Blaine's still finishing up now. Uh, he wrapped it up, right. Jess. Yeah. Jess, Jess is done. Yep. Yeah. Everyone pretty much, uh, pretty much did their plates. That was good. And we're in North Platte, Nebraska. I don't know if anybody mentioned that. North Platte, Nebraska. What is our place here called? San Pedro? Yeah. Yeah. San, San Pedro. Pedro. Highly recommend that. Yeah. Very nice, it's a little nice uh, mom and pop place. It's not a chain. It's yeah. pretty darn awesome. Sweet. Sweet. Yeah. So we were imbibing in their chips and dip and everything else. Well, Joe, where do you think we're headed from here? Uh, Fort Collins. Fort, yeah. Fort Collins, Colorado, and then maybe up towards the western Minnesota and uh, eastern Doretta's for Tuesday to chase. So, right, we're in a kind of a holding pattern right now. By the way, guess who went swimming this morning <laughs> of all of these people? <laughs> it, was, it, was, it was Joe. Right it was there. Joe. Yeah. And, and you kind of had an interesting experience with the ladies of the pool, Joe. Yes, they did. They kind of moved away. They saw me. <laughs> Saw you in your speedo, right? Yep. <laughs> too much. My Daisy Dukes. <laughs> my, my family all know about that one. <laughs> okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. Well. Uh, what can you say? Yeah. There's. Yeah. Seriously. I just probably need to kind of explain that. Yeah. And what was that one horse story you were telling us about? You rode a horse and it uh, led you to the edge or something? Oh uh, yeah, that guy knew that I was green, and he decided he 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 would just. Uh, this is in the Smoky Mountains, and he go out, got off a 1,500-foot ledge and decided that uh, he was going to get a little breakfast here. I'm holding on to him for dear life at his mane. I haven't ridden a horse since. <laughs> <laughs> well, when a horse leads you to a ledge, that's not a good sign. That's not a good sign. I'm totally green. No, right. well, you learned something. Yeah. 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 Well, maybe we should update folks on what we're doing. Well, how about you do that? clearly, as you can see, it's blue sky out the window there. I mean, there's nothing happening there. All the moisture's gone, everything is scoured out. So we're going to have to wait for that to return, and then we can get back into some chasing. But that's going to take at least 24 hours, would you say? Yep. Yeah. So we're probably going to go north into the Upper Plains, maybe the Upper Midwest, before we wrap this thing up in a few days. But for now, we'll just have to make the most of beautiful weather. And that's what we're good companies for here, and why we brought Joe, right? right. <laughs> Jesse, um, can See. you explain, like, do you think one day Tuesday might pick up? Yeah, it looks like maybe up in the northern plains, we got some of that upper level flow coming in, that energy, and it looks like, as Terry was alluding to, there's going to be a little better moisture return. We get that front that push south that kind of clean things out, so it's going to take a few days for the atmosphere to reload. Once it does, that moisture pulls back up there, and then all you need is some sort of a surface trigger to get convection going, so we're hoping that those days will be a little more active. Okay. All right, Paul, do you want to add anything to that? No, he, he pretty much said uh, right. Just uh, going to be a couple down days, and then probably... Maybe something pops Monday in the western Dakotas, and then uh, Tuesday is looking uh, probably central to eastern Dakotas, maybe even to western Minnesota, maybe even warm front place. So 
I think Tuesday is probably going to be the biggest day, and then uh, you know the system clears out again Wednesday and Thursday. So uh, it's been a been a slow year for all of us chasers out there. Uh, nothing substantial at all. There are a few, a few storms this last week, but nothing to nothing to get too excited about. So we're just going to take what we get and hopefully uh, something pans out this week. So we're uh, headed to Fort Collins, Colorado right now. That's right. We're going to check out uh, their brewery. <laughs> Breweries, <laughs> 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 the place where they sell beer, <laughs> um, and uh, and just having a little bit of fun Party today. Up. So we will uh, we'll check back in with you when we get there and let you know how it's going. Peace out, Americans. Peace out, Americans. Right. That's right. <laughs>